Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is me going over Q2 of the weekly contest 243, maximum value after insertion, which is actually, now that I read that out loud, it sounds a little, uh, sounds like an innuendo. But anyway, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord, and, you know, let's chat about this problem and the title. Um, but yeah, so they're, they're actually, you know, if it actually becomes two problems um, because... This is a maximum value, sure, but with, with the negative value, then you essentially convert it to the minimum value, right? Um, and the idea is going to be greedy. And I really should have thought this through, but uh, this, but basically you have s say some number and you're an adding any digit. Um, the the quick way of thinking about it is that. Is that yeah? So you just kind of go from left to right. You try to first place. Okay, this is random. Try to first place where you can insert this to become better, right? And so it, you know you can kind of try. In a way, you're brute forcing it, but um, but you're trying to do it in a implementationally intelligent way. So you try to f try this first, um, and then you know that's that's not going to be the biggest, maybe because you know that this is going to be the biggest or bigger. And then so forth, and then dot dot dot. You you know you move the digits forward, right? And then from that, it's about spotting the pattern of okay, well, you know, if if I'm inserting say a four, it never makes sense to you know in the prefix. If I see a five, obviously you want that to be in the front. And basically, that's the idea that you keep going. And and that's pretty much it. And yeah, and. For the negative number, is the opposite because you're minimizing it. So basically, you start from the beginning and you try to get the first number where it is less than it. Um, try to draw it out, but basically, you, um, the idea is just comparing all these things, but in a very uh, straightforward way. Um, so that's basically my implementation. Um, and because if you do it naively, the length of n is going to matter because the length of n is 10 to the fifth. But if you are able to do, you know, because if you are actually compa comparing strings, you know, constructed strings every time, it's going to be n square. But this will allow it to be all of n in a greedy kind of way. Um, I I told I, I did this pretty quickly, but I got two wrong answers on this one. I'm not gonna lie because. I was rushing it too much, um, and I didn't think it through what happens if they're equal. So my first and second implementation had equal signs, but I only removed it in one place. Uh, and th that's all I got two wrong answers, so today was not my day. But yeah, but as you can see, this is linear time and linear space because we reconstruct the string. Um, and yeah, uh, and if it can't find anything where this is the case, you re I just return the, the uh, I just put it all the way at the end. Um, yeah, that's all I have for this one. Again, let me know what you think. Uh, and you could watch me solve it live and stumble on it now during the contest. Maximum value, okay. Uh, Number then
insert it here. So we turn. Okay, so what's the minimum wire? Otherwise, minimum. Oof. Did I mess up the order? Hmm. Oops, I was thinking about that, but I wasn't sure. Guess I should have checked it more. How oh, about the odd this one then? Oh, wow, I am really bad today. The three we added to the three, but that's no good. Okay, so I, I made that mistake on both places. <laughs> uh, silly mistakes. And also I can see now my new answer. That the same, yeah. Okay, really should have thought that for a little bit instead of wasting 10 minutes on penalties. Uh, yeah, so this was a rough contest and day for me. So, yeah, uh, hit the like button and hit the subscribe button, show me some love, uh, and hopefully, it will bounce back. Uh, as I explain more problems, but I hope y'all have a good, good night, have a good long weekend, and I will see y'all later. Bye bye.